Alibaba's wife launches the Purple Girl Foundation. It's obviously a double celebration today because it's my 50th um, birthday. Uh, I welcome everyone that has come. It's a Wednesday, it's a working day, it's actually a working hour, um, and you've all come out here to rejoice with me and obviously with the foundation. And I'm truly from the bottom of my heart, very, very grateful for everyone that has honored, um, that has honored our invitation. Mrs. Mary Akwabome, wife to veteran comedian Ali Baba, in a grand celebration of her 50th birthday, launches her Girl Child Foundation called the Purple Girl Foundation, which seeks to train young girls in any level of education till they graduate. The event, which doubled as a fundraiser for the foundation, was graced by Reverend and Mrs. Sam Adeyemi, former First Lady of Lagos, Dame Emanuela Fashola, AIG Nigerian Police Tunji Alakwini, actor Richard Mofet Damijo, as well as other top comedians, Nollywood acts and media personalities. Here are highlights from the event. The celebrant. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, sweet sugar, sugar, Mary. Happy birthday to you. May the good Lord bless you. I wish her a happy birthday. Like I told her, welcome on board the flight of the 50s. I'm just a year older than her, and I always tell her, at least if people say I look like a baby, I'm older than somebody, and I'm proud that I'm older than you. The Purple Girl Foundation, as we know, founded by Mary and Alibaba Akpobome, um, is focused on the girl child. With all the statistics that are available, we want to focus on sending girls back to school. She's Mommy Mary not because it's not just a nickname, it's not just people were looking for something to call her. No, she's mommy in every sense of the word. She's she knows how to mommy people. I wanted to say that we all love Mommy Mary. We all love the way she treats us, the gifts that she gets us and how generous she gives it to them and other people. Thank you. A happy birthday because she's finally 50 years. It's not easy to be 50. Adopt a girl. I don't mean get the girl to be a member of your family and change the girl's name to your surname. But take charge to send one girl child to school at a time. They're not looking to go to school in where they're going to pay millions. A little money you can spend at KFC can send a girl to school. The Purple Girl Foundation is basically from the inert personality of Mommy Mary and Ali Baba. This is who they are. They like to give of themselves. Ali's um, being, being non self conceited is the reason why comedians today can make money. The girl child. As we know, we are, we women, we, whatever is put in our hands, with all due respect to the men, but whatever is put in our hands multiplies. So we know that an empowered girl is going to multiply society and therefore the girl child. But on a, on a lighter note, I believe it's Madeleine Albright that said that there's a special place in hell for women who don't support each other. And because I plan to make heaven, it was important that I train the girl child. We have been, we have been involved in a lot of scattered generosity. And we thought, why not just put everything together under one this thing. And uh, purple is my favorite co uh, color. And so sometime early this year, I said we're going to give 30 million to different people who will do businesses. And it was like, why not let's start from the grassroots, let's start from the beginning, let's begin to give people the support and let those people now grow to have entrepreneurial spirit and, uh, and skills. And so she said, instead of throw that money into the uh, social media space, let's make it, to, let's use it to affect lives, let's use it to affect lives, you know. So that's why we agreed to, to do this. A lot of 
a lot of things, you know, is wrong with our societies. And I think that, you know, in as much as we hold government responsible and accountable for most of these things, uh, the basic truth is that government alone cannot do some things. If whatever we as individuals can do to help uh, other people, we should be able to do it. And that's what this foundation is about. Uh, emphasis on the girl child, particularly the disadvantaged girl child like the orphans, the disabled, the people from the lowest income background, or, you know, people who, you know, the, 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 the impact of the foundation can easily be felt, you know, and when they are successful, there's a multiplier effect. So she's our mama, our industry mama as well. And uh, this is um, a very good initiative, uh, doing something for the girl child. Uh, we've all known Mommy Mary to be a giver, to be somebody that, you know, has always been there for people. And uh, coming out with this initiative, I know that the girl child is going to smile. I think congratulations again to Mama Mary for putting up this initiative. It is important. We know the importance of women in the society, but it starts from the girl child education. They must go to school. I'm talking from the stand view of being, I'm a father. I have a mother, I have a wife, I have a daughter, and I have a sister. So I understand the importance of women in the society, but it starts from education. And that's what Mama Mary is, is, is starting up today. You will leave. Your children will leave. The foundation that you have set up to take care of other people's children, God will take care of you and yours. It's only people with great hearts who think of others first. God bless you. Um, I feel very happy. I feel very excited um, as I turn 50. So um, it's a great day. It's a great feeling. And I feel very grateful to God, um, to friends, to family for today.